early. Time to wake up now. What, what time is it? It's time to make another. What do you need that? Oh, shut up. Ten more minutes. Hello again. So even though my last video was an elaborate April Fool's prank and there's actually no such thing as the Eclipse Razor, <laughs> I got you good. This video is about a thing that definitely is real, even though it actually sounds less believable. This week, I'm looking at the Wakey app. Described as a social alarm clock, its aim is to create a community of complete strangers waking each other up. Let me repeat that. This app is for complete strangers to wake each other up, which sounds weird, and frankly, it is. Here's how it works. Before you head off to sleep, you set an alarm. So far, nothing too weird. When that time rolls around, the app will call your phone and connect you with a random person somewhere in the world whose job it is to wake you up via that phone call. Yup, I sh** you not. This is real. The call will automatically cut out after 60 seconds, or you can end it sooner. The app itself calls you and the other person and then connects you so you never actually see each other's phone numbers. And if there's no one around to wake you up at the time you've set your alarm, the app will still call you, but instead will just play a recorded message. Now, to prove how weird and real this is, earlier today I set an alarm and this is the call that came through. There you go. Comes through as Los Angeles, California number. Hello? Hello? Hey man, I'm trying to watch Dexter, wake up. Oh, hi, thank you. <laughs> hey, could you, could you, wait, could you do me a quick favour? Yeah, what's up? Um, I'm, on, I'm actually, I'm filming a review of this app from my YouTube channel. Could you get, could you say, why do I need that? <laughs> it's why do I need that in a really high pitched voice. It goes, why do I need that? Awesome, you're amazing. What's your name? Bye. Bye. See? Weird. This is it. The people just call you because you put an alarm. That's it. But the weirdness doesn't end there. Oh no sirree Bob. You can also choose to be on the other side of things and instead of being woken up yourself by a random stranger, you can be the waker-upper. This screen in the app and the number at the bottom shows how many people want to be woken up right now. And if there's no one with an alarm set at that moment, the app can notify you when someone does want waking up. So that's Wakey and what it does. Now I can appreciate that the whole fundamental idea of this app may sound absolutely horrifying to some people. But I can also see situations where it might be useful. For example, as a less annoying replacement to your conventional alarm, as a way to capture all of your weird dreams. Nigel Farage and Bruce Willis was there, and somehow they were both my dad, but ignore that bit. As a way to learn new and imaginative swear words, because you'll be speaking to a lot of grumpy people who have just woken up. Hi there, time to wake up now. Oh, why don't you just fuck you d Uh huh. Oh, that does sound uncomfortable. Sorry, just stick what in my wear, did you say? As a way to test out your stand-up material, because people who are half asleep are essentially the same as people who are drunk. So if they find it funny, your audience will love it too. Hello. Hi there. So, what is the deal with people who leave newspapers on trains? I mean, what a bunch of twats, right? Okay, do not do the newspaper bit. What else we got? And finally, if you're lonely, just set lots of fake alarms on Wakey and use it to chat to random people. Like a sort of chat roulette, but without the video. Hi there, time to wake up. Also, what are you wearing? Hello? Wakey, you'll be pleased to know, is available on Android, iOS and Windows and is completely free. So go, download and enjoy waking people up for no other reason than just because the internet exists. Now, even though my last video was an April Fool's joke, I did promise I would read out the best comment, so here it is. Ryan Hain wrote, I need an eclipse so I can sell it on Amazon or eBay and make some beer money. Why would anyone want to analyze their shaving data? What a waste of time. Well, correct, Ryan. It would indeed be a waste of time, hence why it doesn't really exist. Ah, I got you good, you got done. You got done, mate. But thanks for leaving the comment anyway.
And I quite like this idea of reading out comments that people have written, so if you leave a comment below this video about the Wakey app, telling me what you think about it, whether you'd use it, when you would use it, then I'll pick the best one and I may indeed read it again in my next video. That's all for this week. Until next time, gadget fans, or something like that.